What's up, Colliders? Welcome back to another episode here of Worlds Collide. I am the Kid JW. This is Miss Diva Talks. What's up, y'all? And this is back, y'all know it by now, Dash Cam Nation. Back with a hot one. Idiots and Cars. Wintertime. I don't think this is wintertime yet, but oh, whatever. We still gonna react to it. It's cold. Because y'all like these for some odd-ass reason. Y'all do. I like doing them until it is wintertime in our neck of the woods. It's like <laughs> negative 10 degrees outside right now, so... We go around this. I put dust in the wrong message out. Calibre bomb to the OTOP news. DC traffic deaths reach a cyber milestone, a high mark. You're not supposed to go over those lines. That's why they're there. Oh. Not seen in more than 15 years. The number of traffic deaths in the city is the most. Yep, I'd have laid on my horn too. With one month left in this year, so far 45 people have died in traffic crashes and deaths. <laughs> So you want to break check somebody? He was honking. That was the honker. He was honking at you. Must have been, man. It's not over. See, me personally, I would have did one of those numbers where if we would have been against the off ramp, I would just let him get in front of me and I just wouldn't shake them back on. <laughs> anyway, I don't think this one has shown. Doesn't look like it. What? I was on my way to work and just spacing out, going through the motions when I did not even look at the light and went through it. Getting hit. Well, at least you admitted you're wrong. You know, I've actually not ran a light, actually, I've not ran a light though, but I had, like, when you go, it's been proven, like, when you go to the same route every single day, your mind automatically just, because it's, it's routine, you're so used to it. So it's like, I've done it before where I'm driving, and it's because I know the route so much. I've only accidentally ran stop signs because of that. Not lights. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I've definitely, I've definitely ran a light. I've ran both of the ones out here. It's like I'm so used to dri so used to the routine. It's just driving. It's just like okay. Oh yeah. But it's that's that's actually normal. Why, why, why y'all both getting out the car though? <laughs> Oh, there is sound, guys. The fact that he that missed that not, whole column. Not that. That's oh. not impressive. What? That's not impressive. <laughs> that drift, though, was nice. That was a nice. That was a nice drift. It would have been nice if they stayed on the road. That too, but just doing it on dirt, that was that was not and also missing the bridge though. But I was impressed by this. <laughs> oh, hey. so neither one of you was paying uh, attention. That was like the <laughs> slowest accident I've ever seen. Uh, right. <laughs> For those of y'all who want to read these, I'm just going to read it to y'all. It says, a car crashed in LaBelle at the intersection of Lawrence Tide and St. Elzar in Quebec. Canada. Oh, Canada. <laughs> Always make sure to yield to oncoming traffic when making a left turn. For those of y'all who actually want to read this for some reason. 
the link is in the description if you want to look at the video yourself. Like, <laughs> it does. Again, blindside sensor was clearly on. They need to the aggressive. They need to be more aggressive. Like the car needs to be more aggressive. So if it's on, with not letting people over when it's yeah. on. <laughs> like how yours won't let you get into the lane if you don't have a blinker on. Yeah, I hate that. Like shit. it needs to be more aggressive to where if you're trying to get, in, it's gonna literally yank you, keep you in your lane. Thank you. What? Wait, what? Hold on. What just happened? Uh, There's so much going on in this video. Press <laughs> come out the back seat. Y'all drunk, ain't y'all? Damn high beams off. I hate that. They need to chill out. I mean, they were in your lane. <laughs> Ass horn. Me. <laughs> that's why I'm not. That's not like, you know what? You go ahead. Turn your lights on, buddy. Right. That's what you get. Right. For not having your lights on. Yeah, right. You clearly hit the whole median. It still ain't got your lights. And Turn shut the little punk on. ass horn up. What the f lights are not on. You just pulled out in front of me. I had to end the f That's great. Your lights aren't on. <laughs> hey, this was last month. No, they weren't. Can you look at them? I know the people behind him is like, what the fuck is going on? Move. He's a good one. Like, what the fuck? Right. I got your plate. That I'm going to report it to the department. And then you're gonna get sued, alright? Uh, I just, I... Just... Bitch, I got a whole dash cam that showed that you was being stupid and didn't even have your fucking lights on. So, who's gonna be found wrong? Alright. <laughs> the thing that scares me, and I said this on Joe's show last night, as awful as Mitch Trubisky and Catch E, and as awful as he's shown us that he is... Oh! He's going to sling a football. He will take shots down. That's what you get for being stupid. Right. Look at you. Card about him. So, if for some reason, the... Nice. See, what went wrong here. The person in the little Honda CRV, they tried to over... They tried to be aggressive. people in Honda CRVs. I can't say them either. I hate <laughs> people in Honda CRVs and them Prius people. I hate them. But and anyway. Equinoxes. And minivans. And Dodge Journeys. <laughs> All of the above. But this person in this situation here overcorrected the steering wheel. When you had to try to do it at high speed, you do not overcorrect... They did this. They thing. were being an ass to the the True. pickup truck. So they shouldn't have done that. Because you do that, your car's going to do the. It's gonna yeah, do the they should have flipped the fuck over and ended up in a ditch. So but. next time, if you're going to do that, do not over correct yourself. Be gentle. With it. <laughs> Mr. Turn. Oh, we see this all the time. Let's see. Well, at least her airbag didn't deploy. But the car is probably still totaled because the airbag deployed. Yep. Why? Go ahead. We we Why? Why the ahead. fuck do y'all do this? Why? Why? This is a car. Like... Why are y'all so lazy when it comes to 
simply cleaning the snow off your raggedy ass vehicles. Why? And I'm only calling your car raggedy because you left so much snow on. How can you even see? How? What? No, no, no the fuck you cannot. And then when you get on the highway, that shit that's on top of the roof blows off into everybody else's windshields. Like people like to what? So in this situation, so what I'm gonna explain to you, people to people who's probably done this before. This is an example of a person who slept way through all of their alarms and they're running late to work, so they just turned the car on, got the windows defrosted, and they figure, hey, you know what, I'm already running late. I'm going to let the rest of the stuff on the car. I'm going to let the wind do the rest of my job. I've been there before. A few times. I've been late. And I'm like, ah. So, yeah, I've been there. I have been there. Felt bad the whole time, though. Felt bad. But I was running late. Couldn't be late no more. That's all right. Karma going to get your asses. Does it, make it, does it make it better that I pull up at the next exit and got it off? Because I was getting fooled? No. Oh, my gosh. Now, in this, this case... This is a ticket. Now, in this case, I understand. So was the other one, but this is even more a bigger ticket because you can't see the plate. Yeah, but in this case, <laughs> you snap necessarily is because if you're driving on a freeway, there's snow and shit from the road, plus the snow itself is going gonna, is gonna to cake up. You're not really going to Stop with this. the excuses. I'm, you're not because you can't give me a ticket if your plate's like this too as a cop. I've seen cop cars like this. The backside is like this. Hell, my car's like this in the wintertime when it's cold as hell like it is right now. Any old excuse. You don't look at the back of your car, do you? Yes. When you're driving? I, how in the hell am I going to see the back of my car while I'm driving? Exactly why his is okay. And but, but I have a backup camera. That's which means if I can't see out the backup camera, that means I need to go take my ass to the back of my car and clean it the fuck off. So you, you, you look at your backup camera while you're driving on the freeway? No, but what I'm saying is, is when I leave home, I have to back out. You don't just pull out? No, not all the time. Oh. You should not have pulled out. You should have waited. <laughs> Definitely should have waited on that one. This lane is ending. This lane is ending. This lane ended. <laughs> He was kind of in his blind spot, though. And you're still in the blind spot. Check your mirrors. First off, I don't like how that freeway is. Right. Like, why are you going? <laughs> you went to two lanes, back to three. Ow! Are you okay, honey? No. Hold on, hold on. Hold I feel on. like you could have. I really feel like they, they could have. That could have been avoided. Because, let's see. Can I, how far? Can I, can because before we replay, I feel like they really could have, like, right here, they could have slowed down. Are you okay, honey? No. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, I, I just feel like they could have they could have been avoided. That literally could have been avoided. Um, yes and no, because it's raining. It's a little slippery. They could have hit the brakes, but I feel like they still might have slid into them, but it pro the impact probably wouldn't have been as bad That's as it was. Like, like that. Yeah. And that airbag definitely deployed. Oh, yeah. Damn. Oh, we got another one. All right. They actually did a replay. Oh, somebody else caught it. Damn. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. That shit's total. Oh, yeah. yeah that's, that's, that's fun. Oh. Trying to avoid his Double stupid plans. ass. The work is done by a professional and friendly crew, and we go Breaks. happy. Don't renovate without calling 310 Reno first. Dial 310 Reno, no area code required, or go to 310reno.ca. This is all bad. This is all bad. This is all... You know, in this case, though, we're going to... It was his fault. Let's see. 
in this case right here, one, you're kind of in the truck's blind spot. Two, True. Why are you still speeding up? Because as a truck, trucks can't see that far. So that's why I don't like being stuck between two semi trucks. You think you I'm gonna blame her just because of her dashboard. <laughs> I blame both of them. Her <laughs> dashboard and all the shit that he got in his uh, back trailer. He's a pickup. He's just... But it's piled high. Why? Pretty much the same reason anybody who has a pickup. Pretty sure it's hindering it. him seeing, which is why he almost sideswiped her trying to get I don't into think that his lane. The mirrors are out, though. Oh, yeah, they are. Yeah, he's trying to pull uh, into get past. He's pulling into us. I know. He was. He did. <laughs> oh. 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 Damn, police car, too. <laughs> Damn, yeah, police car. It's a charger, though. No, the one. This is. Oh, okay. I know, I know, I know that running from anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I was getting ready to say, if I know, I I was getting ready to say, if I was him, I'd turn my ass yep. around to go give his ass a ticket. Yup. <laughs> yup. Got your ass. Yup. Cold and think shit. just because you got a damn uh pickup truck you can do all that shit no right um but yeah um the city but yeah uh <sighs> stupid drivers stupid drivers every day uh same as things that we, we always said to y'all check your check your blind spots and now i gotta add another one stop trying to be the meat between the two semi trucks <laughs> <laughs> because I get terrified, like when I'm driving, and I say, like if I'm driving next to one semi truck, okay, I'm cool. No, not me. I jet past them. My every fear time. Is, is the gasoline trucks. That's why I'm scared. Too. Because I don't need, because I don't need no sparks, and you just become an instant firework. I'm straight. <laughs> um, but stop trying to be the meat between the two semi trucks. Like if you got semis right here and right here, I'm. You got to zoom zoom between that gap or slow it up. Cause. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Nah. And for the love of everything, clean off your car. Yeah. Damn. That she could turn the ice and then boom, it fly off and hit somebody else windshield. And uh, just clean off your car, please. Yeah, because you can let that, you can let that, because that stuff can actually come back if it's frozen and cause damage to somebody That's else. what I'm saying. And whatnot. Anyway, as always, Colliders, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit the like button, share with someone who you think would like it as well. If you're not a subscriber, I don't know why you're not. Again, y'all like these videos. Clearly, we know y'all like them, which is why we keep doing them. Exactly. So, if you want to check out Dash Cam Nation or this video for yourself, if you want to read the subtitles that you can't see because our heads is in the way, the link to this video and their channel will be in the description below, along where you can find me and the official JW on our own YouTube channels. Yup. Bye, y'all. Later.